Hey guys, so I have an Optiplex, let's see, 3060. This is a small form factor machine that I recently purchased and I wanted to install some additional memory on it. Got it with eight gigs and I bought eight gigs on Amazon just because it was a better price than getting the machine itself with the additional memory. So I'm gonna install this on this box here. So this is the Let's see, Optiplex 3060 from Dell, small form factor. They're really nice because it's easy to take off the case. You just unscrew these guys over here. And then this here should just slide off here. All right, so quickly you can see the inside here. And the location where the memory is is actually down here. So we're gonna to have to take this piece off. So you can see my, uh, Dell's really good about showing little arrows as to how to take stuff apart. Arrows here, so I can just move this this way and go like that. And that comes off, and move this down here, there you go. So you can see how easily this comes off. And then this piece here has to come off too. Same thing, you'll see arrows here with the unlock, and there's a, there is unlock. So that should allow me to remove this. Oh, I do have to pop these guys off here. So let's pull up here, up here, and there's one more down here, and then this comes off. And now, let's see, let's wiggle this around. Oh, there it is. So that's locked. You can see the lock right there. And then that's unlock. So that comes off. So then I can slide this. Looks like there's a cable here. So I can slide this off them there. And then this should come off pretty easily. So once I remove that, then you can see that the memory's right here. Here's the SSD. This came with um, 256 gigabytes of SSD. This is the memory that I bought on Amazon here. Can you read what kind it is? So eight gigs, this has eight gigs here. So we'll open this up and we'll install it in the available slot. So I'll make sure to tap some metal here so that I don't have any static on my body. Let's pop this off. All right, so this is what it looks like here. And then we'll slide it here. You can see where the slide is on this side, which matches the slot right over here. So that should easily install. I have to Move this out and move this one out here in these two little clips so it can slide in. So there it's sliding in. And then if you push down on it, and if you do it correctly, it'll automatically click these into place. So I don't even have to put them back in because it automatically does it when it's in. So that's it, it's pretty simple. So then now we're gonna close it up again. We'll put this piece back in. This is the CD drive that's on here and these clips have to go in first. So slide those there. Make sure this cable's on here. And the nice thing is they do provide you another cable here if you wanna connect another drive. You have both cables for that, which is kinda of nice. So all right, so move this back down, slide. Now it's in place. We'll put this orange cable back here, just so it doesn't move out of place. All right, and then this piece has to go back in. Same way as we took it out, slide in this side first, and then we just clip it on there. That's in place. And then we gotta put this also back in. Same thing, slide it here on the bottom. Okay, all three snapped in. And then the case. Same thing there, slide it in. So super simple to do. I had a video before on the micro version, which was as easy as this one. So they're both really great. That's something that Dell does a great job of, allowing you to access it really, really easily. Okay, hope that was beneficial for someone. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.